Hello queens! What's up? Welcome back to today's video. Today is going to be a nail vlog video and this is going to be the first time that I actually get my nails done at 5 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm always up early 8 30 a.m 9 o'clock a.m but today you guys my girl could not do it in the morning so here i am going to her in the afternoon so it feels very like weirdish but just because it's the afternoon doesn't mean i'm not gonna make my coffee i'm gonna go into the kitchen right now and make myself a coffee and then yeah i'm pretty sure i'm gonna be driving out of her house like in the night so that's gonna be different because i'm just always so used to first thing in the morning i always like to get my nails done friday morning just to like you know start off the weekend good here is a little yeah these are literally my nails right now i cannot get these two off at all you guys so i don't know what we're gonna do when we get there maybe a fill maybe a removal i don't know but yeah this is the type of inspiration that i'm going for for today's nails i never thought in a billion years that i would do like something i, I even even almost thought of getting ultimate Ald ultimate almond nails you guys almond 2018 like it would be like almond what do you mean what happened to our xxxxl glittery kawaii rhinestone nails yeah girl it's crazy but you know what at first when i actually thought my caught myself listen, thinking of getting like a short almond i was like oh i'm changing i'm growing up <laughs> i actually started to get a little sad but you know what it's changed and i'm accepting it it is what it is you're gonna change i'm gonna change and yeah you guys i i know my girl was probably hoping that i would get like a spooky set or something but no you guys we're keeping it cute simple espresso vibes brown fall all that type of stuff i am wearing this shirt i'm not really sure if it's fall or like whatever the fuck but this is what I'm wearing with some jeans and literal sandals, you guys. I could change to my Uggs right now, but I am too lazy and I have to go. You guys, she lives like 15 minutes away from me and before she used to literally live like three so there's yeah i have to go ahead i still have to make the coffee and drive but i have a special surprise for you guys i have a package and this package is from a friend that i made on tiktok she here's her in her tiktok right here as you guys can tell from her content that she just goes to shop she shops a lot she's a shopping content creator and she goes to tj maxx she goes to ross she thrifts and i see that she always runs into a specific item and i'm like i can't seem to find any of that crap here okay not crap but you guys know i cannot seem to find not much here so i sent her a little dm and i was like hey girl if you ever run into this item you know, let me know and maybe I can send you some money. Well, obviously I'm going to send her some money and you can send it to me. And you guys, she was able to find it. And now let's go ahead and open it. I'm so excited. What do you guys, well, I was going to say, what do you guys think it is? But I'm pretty sure from the title, you guys are going to figure it out. Um, Let me go ahead and open this real quick. Pink scissors. This is going to be the first time I had a chutcher. Oh my goodness. She is so cute. Look at the charm, you guys. First things first, we're going to take this little strap. It doesn't come off. I'm sure it comes off, but we'll figure her out later. But I'm just going to keep it on for now because we are in a rush, you guys. But look. Look at the little crown. The Juicy Couture tag. This is how... It was not this much dollars. I think it was like $24 or something like that. But I had to pay her the shipping and stuff, which is fine. But I could have done, genuinely got this for much cheaper if I were to find it. But I never find anything, you guys, like ever god you guys look the little zipper okay let's fill her up before we go and i like that it's like the bowling bag vibe um i think juicy couture is starting to slowly get back into the old school type of looks because this is we're doing pretty good for this not bad okay 
so I really do not want the strap here because you guys I, I mean it's not ugly but I don't know it's just not very me maybe like in a year when my, my whole fucking personality changes it will but I feel like right now I just want the this but it's okay let's just go ahead and fill her up i do have to be very careful because she's very like um what's it called she's not terry cloth she's like soft suede and i don't want to messy uh messy her dirty her so let's go oh my god i have a timer and we only have six more minutes before we have to leave so this this my two lip oil combos um and i think that's literally it besides you guys um my keys are in the kitchen this is one that I was able to find at TJ Maxx like two years ago. So now I have two. And this one's like a gem too. She's very gorgeous. The black and the pink and then the huge thing. Oh, I love her. Love her, love, love her. Okay. Last time that I went to go get my nails and you guys, I was extremely late. I was like almost 15 minutes late. 15 minutes late. And ever since that I've been going with her, I have never been more than five minutes late. And even though I have known her for so long, I do not want to take any advantage of her, duh. Because I fucking hate when people waste my time. So, we are not gonna be late. I was thinking about stopping by somewhere to picking up like a coffee, but I really enjoy my coffee, not on some pick me shit, duh. But I don't know, I'd rather have my coffee. Ice, and not even like that, you guys, but also I feel like, I don't know. I'm just like so. Oh, I'm so over drive through coffee. I feel like maybe I just have to find like a good spot. But I feel like the only coffee that's actually ever worth like money is probably like the cute little cafes around here. Expensive, but they're pretty good. I don't know. I just can't seem to get into Dutch Brothers. I know you guys. I know there's a lot of Dutch Brothers fans here, but I just. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Some milk. For my fall nails, we are gonna go ahead and make a pumpkin, pumpkin, <laughs> a pumpkin spice latte. I usually have been, I have been making uh, lavender ice lattes, but today I want pumpkin. Also, you guys, look at my new one. This is the one that I've been using for literally like a whole year. And then, well, multiple of these, multiple, like seven. But this is the one that I got at Target for, I mean, walmart for so much more cheaper six dollars versus 14 and they're doing the same exact fucking thing so if you guys see these at your walmart get them because they do the same thing this shit is a scam okay that is a big spoon and i don't need that much we're gonna get a little separate cup we're gonna do two scoops Ooh. this is gonna be my first iced coffee of the day you guys we're gonna get water, it doesn't have to be hot. It could be medium, cold, whatever. But this is what's left in my tea and my kettle, whatever the fuck. We're gonna do that much. For extra flavor, we are gonna do vanilla extract, pumpkin. Oh shit, actually I have 20 minutes left. Why does my timer is gonna ring now? And then some cinnamon. It's nail day. So welcome to today's nail vlog. Let's make a nice coffee first and foremost. Is that how you say it? First and foremost? Okay. Gorgeous. Beautiful. Pumpkin. This is my pumpkin spice latte. Okay. A little bit more -ish.
I know we didn't get a chit chat after my nails, but here are my nails. How do we like? How do we like? Very cute, very cute. We're really in the fall vibes right now, you guys. I have my Uggs on, I got my yogas on, I got my little long sleeve on, turtleneck vibes with my gold jewelry, but that's every day. Move. Now, you guys get ready for this one. Check this one out. I'm on my way to Dutch Bros. Only I would talk shit about Dutch Bros in a video and in the same video, go and try a Dutch Bros. So I need a coffee. We don't have milk at the house and ice at the house. So I have to get a coffee. So I'm gonna try Dutch Brothers. We are gonna give her a try. I don't know what to get you guys. I mean, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what they have. Do you think they have like a pumpkin spice latte? That's kind of what I usually do with my life is like a pumpkin spice latte. What the? Wow, is there a fly in here? And that was super like dangerous for me to do. Okay, windows are going closed now because I just did my hair. Okay, thumbnail. That's super dangerous too, and the fly is still fucking in here. The fly is still in here. Okay guys, bullshit aside, just like aside, because I keep it real with you guys, I am not having a good day. And yesterday was even worse. I, when I started the video, I was having a great day when I did the unboxing of the bag. But before I got went into my nail appointment, you know. Anyways, we are at Dutch Bros. I don't, why the fuck are they already going to take my order? I'm not even there. Oh my God, I need a coffee that's gonna fix up my mood because I am in a terrible mood. Jesus Christ, I'm literally pulling up and they're going to take my order. How the, how the fuck, fuck is, this, is possible? this possible? Can I look at the menu? Okay, we'll talk right now. We will talk right now. Cause I got some, I got some things on my chest that I need to say. What the fuck do they have? Golden Eagle, don't allow. Creamy vanilla protein. I have no idea. Jesus Christ. Fuck, 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 fuck. Hi. Hi I'm good. Um, do you guys have like a pumpkin spice latte? We don't have pumpkin spice, we have pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie? Okay, I'll do something like okay. that. Yeah. And then we do have the featured drink. It's caramel pumpkin brulee. You can do brevet, chai, or cold brew. It's also caramel pumpkin pie flavor. Ooh, what's the most milkiest? The I'm, brevet. Okay, we'll do that one. Yeah. I'll do that like in a small. A small? Yeah. Small, hot iced or blended? Oh, iced. iced? Okay. Yeah. Anything else for you? Um, no, that should be it. All right, it's going to be six ninety five. Okay. For you. Did you have to add by any chance? No. Oh, no worries. And then we're going to tap right in the middle of the screen for that. Go ahead. Alright, you're all set, and then you're just gonna keep following the car right in front of you. Okay, okay. thank you. Okay, that went well. I look so fall. That's cute. Is this purse fall? Not really, but whatever. Um, yeah, so yesterday was just. I'll just keep it real. Not a good day. Not a good day yesterday. I almost didn't go to my nail appointment because um, um, <laughs> I got in a fight with somebody, a somebody in my circle. I don't want to, I think we know who. Um, I, you, mm, mm, whatever. Me and my boyfriend got in an argument yesterday. I don't care because I'm going to say it. I've been with you guys here for so many years and I don't care. I, you guys need to see the real ups and downs. And yesterday was a fucking down. I'm not really going to get into the specifics. I mean, usually it's never really that deep with our arguments, but it was just, I wasn't agreeing with something. He wasn't agreeing with something. And it just, sorry. Every time I see a ambulance, I pull my hair for good luck. I don't know, my mom said. Anyways, so, um, so yeah, I don't know. It was just not a good day that we started going bickering back and forth before my nail appointment. It had nothing to do with the nail appointment. He actually paid for the nails, huh? But it just, I don't know. It just was not a good day. And also, this is so ghetto. I literally have a freaking fly in my car. 
So anyways, I just, it was, I'm with the dramatics. I will say that I'm with the dramatics. I felt like I wasn't being understood. I was about to start my period. It was just not a good mix at all. <laughs> I just, I was hired. Like, you know, you know, you know the literal period psychosis, the, what we get before we have our period. Well, that is literally what I had. And it was just. Anyways, so yeah, whatever. I just was having like a whole breakdown. It's not anything you guys to be like concerned about or like worried about. I'm just like venting to you guys. Like if we were literally on FaceTime, yeah, me and the mans, we got in a fight and it just, I don't know. I almost didn't go to the appointment because I was so upset and that I was so upset that I couldn't even record the videos. So when you guys saw me there getting my nails done, me and my nail girl were just having a whole therapy session and I'm just gonna keep it honest with you guys. That's what it was. And today, I mean... I just still don't feel very good, but it is what it is. We just keep it moving, you guys. Uh, where are my girlies that have been in a relationship for five plus years, you guys? Because I just wish we had like a huge group chat and like community on how it really is to be in such a long term relationship where the point where you guys live with each other. I'm not saying it's bad, you guys, but every relationship have its, has its ups and downs. But yeah, you guys, that is the literal tea. I almost did not go to my nail appointment because I was very, very, very upset, hormonal and I just was not in a good mood at all. But I did it for us, you know, for the video, for me and you and for my girl, because I do not want to let her down because that would be like the first time I ever cancel on her. But, um, yeah, it's okay. It is a brand new day. I mean, it's Saturday, 4.52 in the afternoon. And my head is actually starting to pound a little bit because I need some coffee or like some type of Coke Zero Diet Coke, some type of like sugar because I have not had any of that this morning but um yeah let's see what this pumpkin what did she say pumpkin breve is about hopefully it's good um and hopefully i like it so maybe we could start doing more like little venting to dutch bros sesh hi yeah your necklace is so cute oh thank you bye thanks God bless the girlies, honestly. Oh, she was so sweet. She said she liked my necklace. Thanks, girl. Thanks, girl. Okay, you guys, here is our coffee. Ah! Me literally driving. Is there anybody behind me? Let's taste this. Mmm. Mmm. It's actually not bad. You guys, we are at Costco now. And as somebody that does not come to Costco ever, I am very excited. This is like fucking Great America to me. So let's look. Supposedly there's Juicy Couture track suits here always, but I never see anything. But I'm gonna take another look. Look at you guys, this cute ass squishmallow. You like that one? This is so cute. Hello you guys. Okay, so we are at Target and I'm just going around. It is like 8.30 at night and we came to get some things and I came to pick up a new e.l.f. grip primer. But now I'm just like in the book section kind of looking around and 
I'm trying to look for the book. Tell me lies. <laughs> Let's see. Should I get it? Maybe if it's here. Let's look. Should I? Okay. Look, you guys. Look who pulled up to say hello. Say hi. <laughs> <laughs> hey, y'all. So it is literally like two days later. And no, it is not morning because I know in the morning I do these little, my little letdown. I haven't done. Uh, I haven't. <laughs> I haven't done. Um blowout socks you know this uh this hair trick hair hat in like a couple of months and i just felt like doing it i did it in the morning i let it go i didn't record it for nothing and then um after lunch i just put it on again so it's probably been two three four five four hours since um i've had these back on so let's go ahead and take them off and see if they work if you put them on for four hours i'm about to record a um, cooking video right now for tiktok i'm gonna make some cum pouch chicken so i was like let me put my hair in socks so my hair is ready by the time it's six o'clock okay cool I'm gonna go ahead and change my shirt just because I don't really want to cook in it. Ugh. I mean, not bad. Way better than it was earlier. So this is going to be my hair to cook. I'm going to go ahead and change my shirt, freshen up a little bit, and then um, get ready to record and cook. Give me five minutes. Okay, guys, I'm back. I got one of my boyfriend's hoodies and I just wanted to be like comfortable. Um, I'm also wearing like gray yogas and this is literally what I'm going to cook in. I know you guys, but I like to be cute, cozy. Hopefully I'm giving off like a little fall vibe. Um, don't forget the nails, you guys. I'm obsessed with the nails and everybody on TikTok is also obsessed. I really need to start stepping out of the French tip um, era. I mean, no, not at all. Sometimes, sometimes it's cute to, you know, discover new colors because this is cute also remember that i got this book at target you guys i am already in chapter three page 46 and my bookmark is literally a straw um so yeah i like it you guys so far so good i really wanted to see the movie but i just never ended up going i don't know why just because i wanted to go with my mom but then she was busy and then i wanted to go with my boyfriend but then he couldn't and i'm just not at the physical level yet where i could do things alone and i admire i praise the girlies that can go somewhere alone but i just could i just can't yet yeah, because I do feel eventually I'll be able to. Um, but for now, I am reading the book and I need a cuter bookmark, you guys, because this is a fucking straw. Anyways, but yeah, I highly recommend the book. It's very good, too. Mr. Ryle already seems like a red flag, but that's basically how she met him as a red flag. And I mean, no hate. 